Hello to all good people of the world. This is Paul Whittakin returning to you today with the Universal Law of Numbers. And what we're doing is we're going to be squaring numbers to infinity. And I'm just setting it up a little bit better. Okay, so uh, we're going to use the 369 code. And what we see on the board is the 369 code. And you see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Now, if we square those numbers, we're going to reduce to 1, 4, 9, 7, 7, 9, 4, 1, 9. And that is basically essentially the code that we're following today. But that's the 147 code. If you take care of the 9s, get rid of them. And the 147 code is uh, the 369 code. And uh, it's just 369 starting at 1 instead of 3. Whereas 258 is 369 starting at 2 instead of uh, 3. And in any case, uh, the, the 369, it acts as a calculator. Uh, not only as a calculator, but it's a calculator without limitations. And this kind of arithmetic we're doing today is not possible to accomplish with a calculator. Anyway, the 369 code, what it does is it teaches us to identify these underlying sequences in these numerical uh, systems. Now, uh, there's going to be, in this type of a sequence uh, that we're doing today, 1 through 9, there is a numerical code, there, is, uh, there are repeating sequences, and if we can identify those, then we can do this arithmetic all very easily, and we can also um, under, you know, uncover what the underlying code is to see exactly what's happening. So this is one big 9, and I'm going to show you how that works. Basically, if we add these columns, these numbers up in these columns, we are going to receive the 369 code, and it'll happen in the fashion that uh, on the left-hand side, adding up these columns, we're going to get 936639, and on the right-hand side of these columns, we'll get a sequence that goes 963369. So the left goes 936639, the right goes 963369. So what's happening is that these numbers are always adding up to 9. And basically, what we're doing is when we multiply these numbers, we create these triangles. So it's interesting, but squares create triangles. And I think uh, triangles create squares, and Pythagoras knew all about that. Uh, basically, what happens is if we consider these as triangles, this one, for instance, uh, this is a triangle with trees but the one would look identical and gets bigger and bigger and bigger. But basically what happens is, if we uh, add up uh, these with the first nine, we'll get this code 669, 669, 669. And then if we do it again with the second set of nine numbers, we'll get 669, 669, 669. So it'll always be 669, 669, 669. But if we add them together, for instance, those, that'll be six and six is 12, 12 is 3, then it gets to be 3, 3, 3, 9, 3, 3, 9, 3, 3, 9, etc. But we won't really be understanding all of that today, per se. However, uh, if you understand that underneath this sequence of numbers is this, uh, this code, and it's the 369 code. So what I'm going to show you first is, okay, so basically, uh, we know that uh, everything's adding up to 9. For instance, 1 and 8 is 9, 2 and 7 is 3, and 6 is 4, and 5 is 4, and 5 is 4, and 5 is 8, and 1 is 2, and 7 is 7, and 2 is 1, and 8 is. And that goes with all of them once we make the adjustments. So you see that uh, it's all revolving around the number 9. So what we're going to do is we're going to first, we're going to uh, learn how to square 3, 6, and 9, and it will be giving us an underlying sequence. Well, it'll be giving us the blueprint, uh, which will be the prototype that we'll use for all of the numbers. It shows us how the system works. 3 squared is 9, 33 squared is 1089, 333 squared is 110889. 99 3 squares, or 103 squared is 99 ones, 10, 99 eighths, and 1 9. A billion threes squared is 999,999,999 ones, one zero. 999,999,999 eights, one nine. So six and nine do the same exact thing. 
6 squared 36, 66 squared 4356, 666 six, six squared 443556. Five, five, then it goes 4444 3456. 5 106 is squared, 99 fours, 1, 3, 99 fives, 1, 6. 9 squared is 81, 99 squared is 98, 0, 1. 999 squared is 9, 9, 8, 0, 0, 1. To infinity. So what we have here is we have this sequence. We have a repeating sequence on the left-hand side. That just keeps on repeating. It'll be, be first it's 1, 1, then 2, 1s, and 3, 1s, and 4, 1s. And on the left-hand side, we have an ending sequence. Here it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 0 is the repeating sequence, and the ending sequence is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So on the right hand side we have a repeating sequence and an ending sequence. The repeating sequence here is 2, 0, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 0, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 0, 9, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, uh, well, 2, 0, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3 just repeats, and as an ending it will go 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, we'll do 2 now. 2 squared is 4, 22 squared is 4, 84. 2, 2, 2 squared is 4, 9, 2, 8, 4. Then it's going to go 4, 9, 3, 7, 2, 8, 4. Then 4, 9, 3, 8, 1, 7, 2, 8, 4. Then 4, 9, 3, 8, 2, 6, 1, 7, 2, 8, 4. Then 4, 9, 3, 2, 7, 0, 6, 1, 7, 2, 8, 4. 4, 9, 3, 8, 2, 7, 1, 5, 0, 6, 1, 7, 2, 8, 4. 4, 9, 3, 8, 2, 7, 1, 5, 9, 5, 0, 6, 1, 7, 2, 8, 4. Okay. Repeating sequence for 2 is 4938271160. The ending sequence, or repeating sequence, on, well, the ending sequence of that is 4938271159 instead of 60. Uh, here it's going to go uh, 3 or 83958067283958067283. Eight, 3950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283950617283
3086419 Okay. The repeating sequence 3086419754. Ending sequence 3086419754. Repeating sequence uh, here 4691358024 Four six nine one three five eight zero two, four six nine one three five eight zero two, etc. And six nine one three five eight zero two five. Seven squared is forty nine. Then it goes fifty nine twenty nine. Then it goes six zero three seven two nine. Then it goes six zero four eight one seven two nine. Then six zero four nine two six one seven two nine. Then six zero four. Nine three seven zero six one seven two nine. Then six zero four nine three eight one five zero six one seven two nine. Then six zero four nine three eight two five nine eight seven nine five zero six one seven two nine. Then six zero four nine three eight two seven zero three nine five zero six one seven two nine. Okay, so the 5 has two dots. 5 turns to a 7. Okay, so uh, 1 and 8 have the same code. Uh, for instance, the beginning re re uh, repeating code on 1 is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 0. With 8, it's 7, 9, 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 9, 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 9, 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And we'll see that before we get to 7901, we have to get there first. 8 squared is 64. 88 squared is 7744. 888 squared is 788544. Then it goes 789965447901. 7, 98765, no, 7901218765444. Four. So look at how that one went with 7901 and 2. Okay, with 7901 and 2, 7901076544. 7901218765444 followed by 7901232987644 that 3 is funny 7901234498765444 the last one goes 7901234552 Zero nine eight seven six five four four. Okay, now we'll do uh, ten of them. One two three four five six seven nine zero zero nine eight seven six five four three two one four nine three eight two seven one six zero three nine five zero oh, six one seven two eight four. One nine seven five three zero eight six four one five eight zero two five six nine one three six three zero eight six four one nine seven five two four six nine one three five eight zero two five six zero four nine three eight two seven one four eight three nine five zero six one seven two nine. Seven nine zero one two three four five six six three two zero nine eight seven six five four four. Okay. So what we have is this repeating sequence on the left, repeating ending on the left, repeating on the right, ending on the right. So if we want to do, let's say, twenty seven of these things, we're going to go two repeating, one ending on the left. Two repeating, one ending on the right. Okay, so um, let's do uh, 18 ones squared. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, zero, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We'll do 18 twos. Four, nine, three, eight, two, seven, one, six. Four, nine, three, eight, two, seven, one, five, nine, five, zero, six, one, seven, two, eight, three, nine, five, zero, six, one, seven, two, eight, four. Four, one, nine, seven, five, three, zero, oh, eight, six, four. One nine seven five three zero oh, eight six three eight zero two four six nine one three six three zero oh, eight six four one nine seven five three zero oh, eight six four one nine seven four six nine one three two one three five eight zero oh, two four six nine one three five eight zero oh, two five eighteen seven six zero oh, four nine three eight Two seven one six zero oh, four nine three eight two seven zero three nine five zero six one seven two eight three nine five zero six one seven two nine seven nine oh one two three four five six seven nine oh one two three four five five two zero nine eight seven six five four Three two zero nine eight seven six five four four. Okay, so that's how we got eighteen of them. Uh, so what we did was one repeating and one ending. If we're going to do uh, twenty-seven of them, two repeating, one ending. Thirty-six of them, three repeating, one ending. Uh, Forty-five of them, four repeating, one ending. If we want to go in between numbers, it's going to go like this. For instance, we'll go to here thirty-four, which is ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 13. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 3, 2, 0, oh, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, we'll do to 81 on 2, which is 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 twos. 4, 9, 3, 8, 2, 7, 1, 6. 4, 9, 3, 8, 1, 7, 2, 8, 3, 9, 5, 0, 6, 1, 7, 2, 8, 4. Let's do, um, okay, we'll do the 82 with 4, which is 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 16 of them. 1975 308 641. 1975 308 24691. 3 5802 Okay, we'll do till 80 with 5 which is 10, 11, 12. 308, 6, 4, 1, 9, 7, 5. 308, 10, 11, 10, 11 12. 0, 2, 4, 6, 9, 1, 3, 5, 8, 0, 2, 5. We'll do till uh, 59 on 7, which is 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 of them. 4, 9, well, 604, 9, 3, 8, 2, 7, 1. Then 604, 9, 3, 8, 2, 5, 9, 5, 0, 6, 1, 7, 2, Eight three nine five zero six one seven two nine. Okay, we'll do uh, till uh, seventeen eights. Seven nine zero oh, one two three four six. Seven nine zero oh, one two three four five six. Excuse me. Seven nine zero oh, one two three four five six. That's seven nine zero oh, one two three four five six. Then it goes. Uh, Seven nine zero oh, one two three four four zero nine eight seven six five four three two zero nine eight seven six five four four. Okay, so that basically gives you enough uh, for you to start playing playing it uh, playing with it yourself and get started. And once again, it's much easier than it appears if a couple of things occur. You understand what the big picture is. 
If you understand the concept of the 369 code, you will understand that you can compute uh, all kinds of calculations with it. Uh, it computes all calculations, uh, you know, because basically what it does is we went 149779419. Well, fine. So if you square a number, it's going to make that code when you reduce the numbers. If you take it to the 8th power, it will give the same code. If you take it to the 14th power, it will give the same code because squared is 2, x to the 2, x to the 8, this thing goes 2487512487512487512. It's doing exactly the same thing. So what happens is when we square 2, we're doubling it. 2 uh, doubled is 4, doubled is 8, doubled is 16, doubled is 32, doubled is 64, doubled is 128, doubled is 256, doubled is 512, doubled is uh, 1024, doubled is uh, 2048, then 4096, but they will always keep on reducing to that. So if you understand that concept, uh, it's a very powerful tool. So my name is uh, Paul Whittakin. And before I sign out today, I just ask people of the world, I ask uh, Americans, I ask uh, Christians, you know, uh, why are we fighting all of these wars uh, uh, around Israel's neighbors? Why, why are we, you know, picking fights with uh, killing people on behalf of, of, of Israel? <laughs> And now, really, America, now there's nothing patriotic about fighting on behalf of a foreign nation. And there's nothing, uh, you know, Christian about aligning with Judas. So I just urge all people to, to boycott Israel, but it really boycott all of these uh, Israeli special interest groups in our country. This anti-Semitic thing, it's nothing more than a made, there's no uh, race that has a, a, has a, you know, a slur for being critical of them, uh, that disallows it. It's just nonsense. If criticizing it, Israel for apartheid is anti-Semitic, if criticizing uh, Israel for meddling in our, uh, not only in our uh, elections, but literally buying outright our government, criticizing that, if that's anti-American, then I am anti-American. If criticizing Israel for apartheid is anti-Semitic, I'm proud to be anti-Semitic, and I think we all need to become, uh, you know, joined together in this anti-Semitism to criticize these people to stop the apartheid. My name is Paul Whittakin, and I wish all good people of the world peace and happiness.